All right, bucked off, then stepped on. That's what happened to a Collinsville 16-year-old when she mounted a horse for what was supposed to be another typical ride. Mallory Thompson shared her story with Two Works View's Sierra Pizarro and says that she's very thankful she had her helmet on. Sierra. Bucked off wasn't enough. It then stepped on the side of her head, cracking the helmet. But for the most part, Mallory Thompson was kept safe. Taking full advantage of a close-up is 18-year-old legend. He's a rope horse with many awards, now including one titled Most Unforgettable. I've never been more terrified in my life. Legend belongs to Heather Galvin, but is frequently ridden by her friend, Mallory Thompson, who knows him as a calm-tempered horse. They're animals, they're living things. You can't always like predict what they're gonna do. When Thompson mounted Legend, as she always does last month, something happened. He started bucking and the only thing I could think about was trying to like stay up on the horse and I was hoping at some point in time maybe he'd stop. She held on for about three jumps before falling backwards. I actually blacked out after I hit the ground, but we realized that that was actually from me getting stepped on. You could say legend stepped on the right spot, an area covered by Thompson's helmet, which cracked and cut her ear. It was really scary because I could feel like blood and stuff coming out of my ear. And I saw the hoof come down on the side of her face and I, I thought he stepped right in the middle of her face. Thompson spent one night in the hospital and was cleared, leaving with only a back injury. If I hadn't been wearing mine, the doctors and everybody told me that I wouldn't be here. Galvin and Thompson take the incident as another reminder that a helmet just might save your life. I'm definitely not riding ever without a helmet. Horse riding injuries typically affect girls between the ages of 10 and 14. That's according to the British Medical Association. Their study also shows with horseback riding, head injuries are the most frequently occurring and are the leading cause of death. Mallory Thompson says as soon as her back and ear heal, she's going to get right up back on there, right on the horse and legend. She's not afraid to get back on him either again. I'm Sarah Pizarro, two works for you.